most people in life are looking for how do I make a life worth living in retirement with having. Isn't it a fascinating thing that I have recently purchased two pairs of shorts from City Trends? But my challenge is when I go today after it has been in my bag now for a couple days to find that they are not the shorts that I purchased. You see, the first time I purchased the shorts, I found they didn't, they didn't fit. I could get them on, but I couldn't get them buttoned. Today, so I went back to the store and I got a larger size very strategically using an employee to do so and another employee to make the exchange. Afterwards, I communicated to the corporate office how I felt about how that exchange with regard to inventory was sort of handled, but again, I'm not an employee in the company. I'm just accustomed to standard operating procedures in most organizations of retail. But here's the deal. Today, when I'm trying to put some new shorts on that I've just paid for, 20 bucks or so more, I find that they are even smaller than the shorts that I returned. I'd like to know which of these motherfucking employees thought they had the right to talk to someone about my purchases. I'd like to know which of the fat ass 400 pound people who run that store or the lesser value people that you like to make fun of and more don't have a right to buy property without some little fucking black bitch playing around with their property in the night. Or is it a policeman who just can't get enough? But let me tell you, little motherfucker, God is coming for you. And I am so fucking angry now that I promise you that the people that I'm about to work for will take every fucking one of you to your knees.